On the table, it is the Transformers BotBots Challenge. And to thank you for Hasbro Toys for allowing the squirrels into the challenge by sending this free Transformers BotBots Series 2 sample product pack over. What is inside has certainly caused the squirrels a stir. I'm stuck! Yes, Landry Squirrel has already stuck himself on the pull tab. Let's open up and unleash the BotBots Challenge. What do we got in here? Holy squirrels! I can't believe they packed that many BotBots in that one box. We have a ton of Series 2 multi-packs included. And in the center of the box, a large box of single-packed BotBots. Truly amazing, Hasbro. New tribes have joined in on Series 2. Up top we have the Swag Stylers, Music Mob, and Spoiled Rottens. And from the first series, of course, Shed Heads, Backpack Bunch, Lost Bots, Greaser Gang, Toilet Troop, Sugar Shocks, Techie Team, and Jock Squad. And with Series 2, we have 60 new characters and 10 new rare characters in there. It is now time for the Bot Bot Challenge! Did you know that some Bot Bot characters are especially hard to find? Hidden among the rest are rare three-star bot bots. These are elusive little bots and only appear when they're feeling particularly mischievous. Start a timer just before opening your first package and see how fast you can find a rare character. As soon as you find a three-star bot, stop the timer and post your time with Bot Bots Challenge. I think the squirrels are game. So inside the center box, this must be a shelf displayer we can find on stores. All right, time for our Series 2 Transformers BotBots Challenge. I have a feeling there will be packaging everywhere. Begin the timer! Here we go. Ah. Something from the backpack group. No lost bots, an overpack. Ah, another Lost Bots. It has to be this really cool meaty one. Hammerai. What a name. Hammerai. I'll be transforming these in a bit. Let's just see if we can find our possible three-star Bot Bot is what we are looking for. Who is this? Looks like a hot sauce bottle. From the Greaser Gang, Sir Bacha. There are so many of these I have to keep going back to the guide. What is this? What is this? What is this? It's like half transformed already. Ah, from the Swag Stylers, it's Frizzle Fry, so it's like a hair dryer. I see it now with the cord. I'm going way too slow. I'm going to so lose the Bot Bots Challenge. I'm trying to identify before I really find the rare. Oh, a shoe. Whose shoe is this? From the Jock Squad, the insole. Very nice. We see our timer. Two and a half minutes so far. What is this? I always like the drinks. From the Spoiled Rotten's Atomic Freeze, a one blue star. Falling behind, falling behind. This has got to be Music Mob. It's a drum set. Dumb Beats. Everybody, Dumb Beats. From the Shed Heads, it's Sandy Man, a double blue star. I didn't get many Shed Heads last time, so I'm excited to see. Now, if I recall, and I've been so excited to open these, inside each pack tells you who you're looking for. Tropic Guzzle Rush. From the Jock Squad, that already confused me again, but this might speed things up in identification, because now I can just look for the guide inside. Ooh, I like the tech stuff. The tech team, it's Tectonic Sonic. From the Sugar Shocks, it's Javasaurus Rex. Hey, it's a three star, it's a three star. 
Is it, is it, does it count? Does it count? It does, it counts! Ah, stop the timer! Six minutes and seven seconds. Or can I say six minutes? Because I took me a minute to identify. I did it! That is my time with the Bot Spots Challenge. Six minutes and seven seconds. Crazy. Not too bad. Funny, it's the Javasaurus Rex. I do not like coffee. But there we go. Very cool. I do like Tyrannosaurus Rexes, though. Let's do a quick transform on this one. That one's actually pretty darn cool. Okay, so where are we at? Opening a three-star bot on the 11th try. Let's just finish up this display box and then we can transform them all. So continuing on. Whoa, what is this? Back from the music mob. It's a pink key pop. Oh, there's the keyboard. What is that? From the techie team, we have found Glitch Face, double star. From the Jock Squad, we have found Ice Sight. So is it some sort of binocular thing? Why is it in the Jock Squad? Why am I not getting that one? Swag Styler. It's a Oli Bite. Looks like a hat. Level one blue star. Hat with some teeth. Very creative. From the music mob, we have Songwave. Ooh, this will be great for Soundwave Minion. At first I thought it was one of those little Roomba vacuums, but no, you can see the speaker on top. Very cool. Some bread. From the Lost Bots, we have a PB Junior, a blue star level. Looks tasty. Oh, we're at the back of the box finally, sort of. From the Lost Bots again, we have the Detangler. Oh, always important in our family, the Detangler. Thing of milk, maybe. We have, from the Spoiled Rottens, Grumpy Clumpy. Ooh. That can't be tasty. The Greaser Gang, we have Mustard. Mustard, that's gross. Blue Star. From the Techie Team, this would be TV Cop. Two Blue Stars. Oh, I love the technology stuff. They work really well with your other Transformers. We found from the Toilet Troop, Captain Swoon. So a nice smelly soap dispenser. That looks kind of familiar. From the Sugar Shocks, it's King Candy Hoofs. One blue star. And our final bot bot, our final bot bot in this huge package of, how many were in here? I've already lost count. Our final bot bot. Another drink. And Sugar Shocks, it's a Sippy Berry, a blue star. So in a box of 24 BotBots, only one three-star rare BotBot, the Javasaurus Rex over here. That was tremendous fun though. Let's organize a little bit and see these guys a little closer. Let's organize by tribe. We are in the Lost Bots. We have Hammerai, PB Jr., the Detangler, and Overpack. Let's transform these and see how they look. And it transformed. When you first get a bot bot out of the pack, they're always a little stiff. Takes you a few times to really get those joints moving smoothly. And standing. Hammerai is looking very cool though. And this might be my first bot bots with an accessory. The bone pulls out of the ham and is actually a sword concealed inside. Very nice touch. PB Jr. obviously having a tough time standing. The back panels of the sandwich will weigh him down a little bit in back. Very goofy face. Always dreamed of a peanut butter jelly transformer. Then we have the Detangler. I love how cute the Detangler is trying to look, even though possibly very evil. It can be a painful process. The last Lost Bots we have is Overpack, a transforming orange backpack. Pretty well all around good on that one. Lost Bots, let's go on to another tribe. We didn't find anything out of the Backpack Bunch tribe, so we go right on to the Swag Stylers. We have Oli Bite and Frizzy Fry, a chomping hat and a blow dryer. Let's transform these two, see what they got. 
And of the two transformed, Olibite must be a Sharktacon hat. Very aquatic-like. I like how you can open and close the mouth. As for Frizzle Fry, a pretty simple bot bots. I like the cord on her back the best. Those are the Swag Stylers. Found a couple characters from the Greaser Gang. Looks like bottles of mustard and hot sauce. Sirbacha and Mustard. Let's transform these two. And there we go with these two. Pretty simple with the bottle transformers. Panels that flip down, arms that pull out, and legs that go down. Sometimes the panels in the back make them back heavy though. I like the green arms of Sirbacha. They stand out really well. Those were the Greaser Gang characters found today. Next up from the Jock Squad we have Tropic Guzzle Rush, The Insole, and Ice Sight. Still trying to figure out Ice Sight. Are those some sort of skating binoculars? They have a band on the back there, a nice yellow band, very sporty-like, but I just don't know what this is. Anyone got a clue? Let's transform these three. And there we go with these three. Tropic Guzzle Rush, another bottle. Good face on him. The insole. That's one happy shoe. Would be nice to find a couple of those. Make a pair for any Transformer. And Eyesight. Looking kind of old and blind, maybe. Confused on that one. That is the Jock Squad. The Music Mob is up next, one of the newer tribes. We have Songwave, Dumb Beats, and Key Pop. Kind of a fun group. Let's transform. Songwave a little tight, difficult to transform, kind of tricky to stand with the back panel. But a nice wireless speaker, another great transformer to add into your normal transformers. Dumbbeats was a pretty fun BotBots to transform, felt a little different going with a drum set. Kind of a fun face on that one. And Keepop might be the most challenging BotBots so far today. Once figured out, fairly simple, but trying to get the shoulder strap band bent back and the arms where you want, a little bit tricky. Pulls off pretty well though. Music Mob were fun to play with. For some reason, I never find too many shed heads. Here we have Sandy Man. Took me a minute to figure out what this is. Well, duh, a sander. You can see the sanding belt on the bottom there. For some reason at the start, I thought it was some sort of bulldozer, but that would have been way too big. Let's transform. And there we go. I like this one quite a bit. It falls on a more serious side of BotBots, and it could be used in many different ways. And we go to the Sugar Shocks, with a Sippy Berry, Javasaurus Rex, and King Candy Hooves. And Javasaurus Rex being our three-star rare again. These three minus Java looking delicious. Let's do a quick transform. So Sippy Berry looking ultra sweet. Very vivid color on that one. Javasaurus Rex, even though I'm not a big fan of coffee, this is a very well designed BotBot. I like the cord tail in the back, and the way it transforms, I can see why it has a three-star status. Then we have King Candy Hooves, really familiar BotBots. I had to dig into my Series 1, and sure enough, we've seen this one before. So now there's a couple Candy Hooves walking about. Still very clever. Three from the Techie team, easily my favorites. We have Glitch Face, TV Cop, and Technonic Technoticic. That one's hard to say. And Technotic Sonic. There we go. These of course being awesome because they are so interchangeable with regular Transformers. Let's transform. And transformed, all looking delightfully silly. Glitch face with a massive glitch face. I'm actually surprised it's standing right now. It's kind of side heavy. TV cop looking good. We have an officer's uniform underneath that TV. No face with a bot, but I kind of like it that way. Please, TV cop, let me watch TV tonight. And Technotic Sonic looking like the most realistic of the group would be a nice wireless speaker for Soundwave. Only one toilet troop today, darn. I like the toilet troop. They're funny. We have Captain Swoon, a blue star level. A delightfully fancy soap dispenser. Let's transform. Captain Swoon transformed. Now I'm starting to get the Captain feel a bit. Very pirate-like with a soap dispenser hook for a hand. Looks like a peg leg down there, eye patch. Pretty funny looking pirate. Silly that they went with pirate and soap dispenser. Going to have to look out for some more toilet troop. And for the last tribe of the day, from the Spoiled Rottens, a new tribe. 
Grumpy Clumpy and Atomic Freeze, Spoiled Rotten's very Grocery Gang-esque, let's transform. Grumpy Clumpy, probably my favorite of the two. I like how his front panel looks technology-like. Atomic Freeze also looking good. Probably something that Megatron would drink. And uh, there we go with the Series 2 Bot Bots we found today in the Bot Bots Challenge Box. That was 6 minutes and 7 seconds to find that rare 3-star Bot Bot. That was crazy fun, I had no idea we were going to go through so many bot bots today. At the beginning of this vid, when we opened up that giant box, there were several Series 2 multi-packs. I will have to catch up with those on a different video because there are so many more inside. This group on the table currently found from these single packs. What crazy fun, bot bot Series 2 is alive and well. Now I just need to figure out which ones are Autobots and which ones are Decepticons. Transformers Bot Bot Series 2 arrives on store shelves Spring 2019. There are many single and multi packs to collect, with 3 new tribes, 60 new characters, and 10 new rare characters to explore. Series 2 will keep you busy. If you enjoy the small, simple things transforming and chasing you across the house, Bot Bots are where it's at. They're small and silly characters, very addicting. You'll want to collect as many as you can bot bots. So that's what I have to say about that. I request a Squirrel Tribe for Series 3. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please like, share, subscribe. <laughs>